to win a star Michelin has been incredible, you know, all the staff is, is incredibly happy and I feel very, very proud. Well, to win the star Michelin, I mean, today you can see the faces of the staff, you know, they all coming with a massive, massive smile, make me make goosebumps, okay? It's incredible, uh, it's, it's one of the best things that can happen as a chef and as a, as a manager, so all the stuff. Um, people have been working very, very, very hard. It's a really difficult restaurant because we are really busy for lunch and dinner, like, like a queue is going out for hours. And uh, to maintain um, the quality of the food, you know, it's, it's really hard, it's really difficult. To win a Star Michelin, it wasn't, you know, I never thought we were going to have a, a Star Michelin. No, because uh, the staff and the place, it doesn't deserve it. Just because, you know, it's just the way it's the setup. But finally, you can see, um, you know, the changing. And the main thing is, it's a great food and a great service. Yeah, it feels really good to win a Michelin star. Like um, there's a great buzz in the team and the um, and the restaurant in general. Um, you know, it's a, it's a day after now, um, starting to sink in a little bit. I think yesterday, like um, everyone was just cooking on like adrenaline from that, and you know, so it's, it's a great achievement and um, a great bonus for the team to have uh, won this. Yeah, I think um, some people um, look at us as not being the, uh, an average restaurant. Um, you know, you walk through um, our, the other side of our restaurant, Bubble Dogs. This is like a very busy restaurant just serving hot dogs and champagne. You come through a curtain and then there's 19 seats where you can see exactly what we're doing. So it's not like stereotyped, um, you know, tables, chairs, um, tablecloths, all, all of that. Uh, style restaurant so you know I think Michelin are um, you know we, we've seen it with um, from pubs to from a lot of different style of foods now uh, Indian restaurants and you know if you're good enough and you're cooking good food you know Michelin are out there and they're rewarding you with uh, the award that you deserve you know? we don't cook to you know when we turn up at work every day we're not thinking like you know we have to win a Michelin star this is how we're going to cook to win a Michelin star and it just feels really great uh, knowing that we won one by doing what we believe in and what we want to do so just having one now and, and it like gives you a bit you know a massive ball of energy to sort of like come off on and like come we, we want to be better now and like carry on like like we've achieved this and you know instead of like just maintaining or carrying on as we were like you know we want to up our game now and like you know see 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 what else we we can achieve in the future. It feels amazing. Um, you know, a lot of hard work's gone into it, and you know, we we put in a lot of a lot of work, a lot of like blood, sweat, and tears, so to speak, and just sort of like get the recognition and things for it. It's it's amazing. You know, it's not something that we we try and go, and that's what we definitely want to do. But you know, we want to hit a certain level and just to sort of be appreciated in that way is, is great for us, yeah. I was actually I was actually not in the kitchen, which is a bit of a surprise, but um, I was in Hong Kong with Jason. We were doing, um, we were working on one of his other projects, so we'd nipped out there for a couple of days, and then um, and then yeah, I got back on Saturday, so I came straight back from the airport and came in to, to congratulate all the boys. Yeah, it's, it's good, as, you know, it's, the phones have just gone crazy. We were already really busy and sort of pretty much fully booked, but, you know, it's just, the demand's just gone up, like, absolutely crazy, yeah, so the phones haven't stopped ringing since Thursday. Um, well, they're obviously over the moon as well. Um, they, we went into partnership with them and they sort of asked us to come in and do this restaurant and for the name we are, you know, to bring in sort of Jason Athens' name and to bring in his, you know, style of restaurant into their into their building is what exactly what they wanted and sort of we've lived up to our side of the deal and delivered the restaurant of the standard that we want to deliver.